did you, how did you think England handled it uh, uh, as someone who's perhaps been through similar circumstances itself? Yeah, I think they handled it uh, fairly well. It's a difficult situation. Yeah. This is there's no there's no absolute way to deal with this situation, no. and, and and obviously the. The, the powers that be are finding it difficult to, to with the sanctions and yeah. the punishments, so that tells you that. But the England team, I thought, done okay with it, and I think that I'm of the mindset: punish them on the pitch, yeah. beat them, not walk off the pitch, not walk off the pitch. Although I would say that that the the way that it was dealt with at Haringey, yeah. with the Oval game. Obviously, lower leagues, but when both teams come together, if the two teams come together, together, that's what I've always uh, thought. If a home team I was came very off, that would okay make a big difference. Well. And I like that, and that's, that shows unity yeah. from the football world, from the players, from the staff, mm. and, and, and of them two teams. And that was, a, I think, that's a good sign mm. for other teams to look at. Yeah, you experienced something similar. Was it in Spain? Yeah, we played against ago? the Spanish national team. I don't know if you guys yeah, played, but yeah. we played against the Spanish national team, and yeah, there oh, was you're on the yeah, bench there. Yeah. There yeah. was racial yeah. racial chants and, and sound noises and whatnot yeah. in the stadium, and. How does but that it make wasn't, you feel, Rio? I mean, yeah, you, you, you're gutted. You, you think, what, 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 what the hell is going on? The ignorance that you, you, you sense, and it gives a bad representation for mm. that for that country because that that almost it tarnishes your the image of that country yeah. um, that you're you're playing in, and it and you have to understand that it's not everyone in that country that that, that represents, but it's a yeah. small minority who have got a loud voice, mm. and it's it, it, now with the implication of social media goes everywhere quickly. It's, it's a very difficult thing to know how to deal with it in the correct manner and how to punish people in, in, in the correct manner, isn't it? And it's, it's, it's for football as well, it's, it's difficult, isn't it? Because it seems to be, people say it's a football problem when we all know really it's a society yeah. problem. And, and the thing about football in many ways is it's, it's a great shame is that football is actually a great example of how uh, yeah. So many diverse people from diverse countries all over the world in different colours come together in a dressing room and actually have real harmony. So in, in many ways, football sets a good example, but sometimes what happens on the terraces? I mean, obviously, even, even, even within footballers as well, there will be exceptions against that, but pretty rare. Yeah, no, I just think that, that listen, that the solution is what everyone's searching for, and it's very yeah. difficult, but I think the federations, I think they can set the tone in some ways. Yes, this is an educational problem, this has to be addressed in that yeah. sense from an education standpoint, but the federations can be people that do set the tone in terms of punishments, Give the right punishments that, that fit the crime, and I think it's far too often at the moment the the, the, the penalties what, what, that are being what, sent what out. What should right. the, the punishments be? Perhaps points, or is it the one thing that really affects football clubs and probably their supporters is to be dot points or victories, etc. Do you think? Colin? Yeah, Real's right. They, they, ha yeah. they have to do something, but I just think the one thing about football dressing rooms, the player, for the yeah. players, you know how it is. Yeah, you know, players don't see colour; they just no. see players, and they so get he's together. He's a good player. He can cross it. The he great, can defend. You know, he great, can make great saves. The great saves. teams we played on, you know, the, yeah. the camaraderie was so special, and there was there was no yeah. colour there. And yeah. I just think a football dressing room is a beautiful place when it when it functions well. And I think they need to take that on onto the terraces because players don't see colour. And I don't yeah. think for players sometimes in those moments in Spain. Yeah. This confusion, why people, why those issues still persist yeah, just when one, they shouldn't. One brief thing, I saw Jamie Carragher and, and Patrice Evra last night mm. talking about the circumstance in 2011, which was a problem between footballers on the pitch, and Jamie Carragher apologises for the apologised for the way Liverpool behaved. Yeah, that's eight uh, in years, that, that's eight eight years, years on, but it's, eight years is, that, is that progress? Well, testament to Jamie Carragher yeah. for apologising eight years after the incident. Yeah, um, you were on I mean, you were on the pitch that day, presume? Yeah, I was there on yeah. the pitch, um, but. Mm. But I mean, I've, listen. At the end of the day, I think it's it's bigger than Jamie Carragher. It's a club. Yeah. Liverpool let themselves down that day yeah. while wearing the t-shirts in support mm. of someone who's been accused of a racist mm. comment. So, yep, eight years on, and still the apology hasn't come from Liverpool in that sense. But I just think that the game's moved on from then in in, mm. in terms of the narrative now. What what people on the edge of everyone's tongue at the moment is racism. At that point, then it wasn't. Mm. So people were kind of startled into yeah. like, what do we do? What do we do? Yeah. Even more so now. Mm. We're still sitting here saying, what do we do? But is it a good thing so, people are talking about it? It has to be, doesn't it? It has to be, yeah, because yeah. then you, then things can be done. But I just, it, it's not a T-shirt that's going to change it. Oh. It's not a, a day in a season that's going to change it. it it's, it's more education. than that. It's education, definitely.